on the box all around. And what I want to do is I want to uh, order these. So I want to view these as an animation. All right. So one of the first things I'm going to do, I'm going to pull back quite a bit so I can't actually see what it is that's being presented. Tilt this up just slightly. And in my views at the top, there is going to be a drop down menu in view that says animation and it says add scene and you see scene one being added at the top all right so my next scene is I'm going to zoom in to see the first text and bring this down so it's centered and I'm going to click view at the top which drop downs into animation add scene. All right. Now I'm going to rotate over here to the second text. Zoom out a little bit so I can see it. I'll rotate down just a little bit. So I'll click view at the top, animation, add scene. Is going to be view, animation, add scene, the next one. Fourth scene, fourth text, view, animate, add scene. get in trouble and you can't find out where you are, you can zoom out. Turn mine upside down. Flip around. Back to where I want to be. Zoom in. So my next scene, view, animation, add scene. And the next one, view, animate, add scene. the last one. Now, later on, I don't want this blue line to be around it. It's selected right now. So I'm going to click the Select tool, select something else. Actually, I'm going to select the background. There, and that deselects this area. I'm going to zoom back in. And this is going to be my next scene I'm going to add. And what I'm going to do, just to end this completely, I'm going to zoom all the way in 
to white space. This will be my final view. Animation. Add scene. Okay. Now, here's my first scene. And if I go back up to view at the top, in animation, I can have it play. And we'll see what we got. Okay, that didn't turn out too bad. And then this repeats through, and you can continue to see this presentation. So give it a try. Just see if you can get the mechanics first, and we'll see what you end up with.